What's going on, people? It's another beautiful day in LA, man. It's actually beautiful outside. Y'all don't talk about me because I ain't got no haircut, I ain't got no shaving, nothing. But hey, I'm hungry. Y'all been requesting this place for so long, bro. I've been seeing this comment again and again and again and again and again and again and again. Today, we are headed to Tev's Kitchen, man. I've been seeing, bro, stuff on my timeline forever bro he got oxtail chicken wings salmon a little bit of everything man i'm excited for this one man let's get up out here and see what's going on it's another cool day outside in the city man you see we over here on 48th and gramercy bro you know what i mean i don't really spend too much time around this area i be trying to figure out where i am half the time though what's up nah you good bit dog what's up with you all right, man, you know, the community always showing love, of course. I think this is it right here, I believe, right? We've arrived at the spot, man, Tev's Kitchen. Hey, I, look, I heard, I heard bro started out of his, like, house or something like that, and he just got this spot. This mother just started. What's up with you, big dog? 98 years old right here. 98 years old. I'll take him everywhere you be What's up? How you doing? How you doing, bro? How you doing, bro? How you doing? 98 years old. You 98 years old. 98 years old this man is right here. What's up with you, big dog? What's up with you, man? Nice to meet you, bro. Look, bro. Ted, oh, this Ted. This Ted right here. Look. Look. Bro, when I tell you I done got 85 million comments to come try your food, man. I can't even talk, man. Whenever you're ready, let me know. Yeah, no, I'm about to come back there and talk to you, big dog. I'm For sure, we come through. All right, all right, so wait, you 98, man? Yeah. All right, so look, if you can go back and tell your 28-year-old self anything, what would you tell him? Anything. Anything. Just anything. don't die. Just don't die. Well, hey, 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 well, ain't gonna die then. I ain't gonna die. I'm looking around right now, you know, and I ain't gonna cap. It looked like he got some good food chopping up out of here, boy. What's up? How you doing? How you doing? I'm good, thank you. I'm good. I'm well. Welcome I'm well. to Tez and Family Kitchen. Good to be here. Good to be here. Love the customer service, though. <laughs> customer service, 10 out of 10. Okay? So talk to me, though. When you come up here, what you got to order? Like, what's what's the move? That's what's what I'm trying to figure out. Yeah. Sheesh. Right now, we got the short ribs yeah. back from, from a long time ago, and it's been popping today, so I would recommend the short ribs. But everybody loves the sweet chili wings, too. Yeah. So I'm like, you know, you, you can get the best of both worlds. Okay, okay. So y'all got the jerk wings, sweet chili wings. Okay. No jerk wings. Ain't no jerk wings? Not today. Ah. Yesterday, okay, okay, okay. You know, Ain't no oxtail today. Breakfast? No, Sundays. Okay, oxtail it's only on Sunday. Day, okay, y'all be switching it up. Broccoli and a drink. I get all, I get all the sides on it. Okay, yeah, okay. I'm right, I'm right, I'm right. I'm right. I'm right. Oh, wait, 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 I'm too excited right now. Wait, wait, wait. <laughs> That's why I'm trying to get it right for you. Yeah, okay, okay. The customer service score keep going up in here. 40, 35, 75. All right, so we 75 bucks down, you know what I'm saying? Okay, oh that's look, okay. That's cool. That's cool. We're going to see what the portion looking like. You know what I mean? <laughs> look, I ain't judging a book by its cover just yet. Hold on, y'all got the kid working and everything them. back here. Cameron, introduce yourself. What's up with you, bro? I'm Alex, man. Order for Brian. I'm Cameron. Cameron? That's, oh, that's my cousin name. <laughs> yeah, yeah, okay. Well, we going back here? Mm -hmm. Hold on. Hold on, player boy. Hold on. He got the crew going up back here. He got the crew going up back here. Sure. What's up, dog? Making yours right now, man. Yeah! Oh my God! Hey man, I'm excited right now. It's smelling exquisite over here. To be honest, hold on. What you got right here? Short ribs right here. Short ribs. I just ordered some. I just ordered some. Yeah, this is short ribs right here. We got short ribs. We got jerk shrimp. That's short ribs, yeah, jerk uh, shrimp. Okay, 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 okay. I'm gonna get the plate. plate huh? Now this is yours though. This is mine too. That's yours though. Hold on. That's I, yours. Oh. Give it for it. I don't want to cheat. I don't want to cheat. <laughs> I, I want my first reaction. Right, no, when I get no the plate. cheating. No cheating. Hold on. Short ribs right there though. You know that look mean? good. Uh, yeah, oh yeah. my God. Look at this. <laughs> I smell it from over here, <laughs> dog. It's a little, little piece. Jiggle. Oh my jiggle. god! Hold on, dog. Hey, hey. Look, look. I know that uh, you was just selling plates at first, right? Yes, I just. Yeah. And how long you been open here? 
I've been, well, I just got here in November. We just opened up in the last of December. We're still not fully open. Yeah. We was outside on the block, but the rain, the wind came inside, you know, yeah. it happened right here. Hey, dog, I've been hearing your name all over L.A., dog. Like, what, 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 what inspired you to start doing this, bro? Man, it's just a way, you know, just to break generational curse, bro. Honestly, because, you know, we wasn't from out here originally. None of our family. And I can say that it's opportunities, but you have to be willing to work. Yeah. You have to get out there. No matter what nobody say, you got to be willing to work. Yeah. And if you go help your family, that's your whole motive. Like, you can't stop helping. You got to go until, until it's your time. You know what I'm saying? Hey, so for anybody out here who want to start their own food business, because there's so many of the people watching right now right. who want to do what you do, bro, what would you tell them right now? Just do it. Don't be scared. You know what I'm saying? It's like you think about, I want to work out. When to start Monday? When to start Monday? No. One day I just got up, man, we cooked some food, and my boy was like, you better sell this. I'm like, what you mean? And then I started selling. $10 a plate, $8 a plate, $5 a plate. Now, six years later, we are here. Have a whole restaurant. Wow, six. It's been a six-year grind for this. And look at that. Hold on, open that back up. Look at that. Short look at that, dog. Right. Oh, my God. Mm-hmm. Mm -mm -mm. That's the short rib. That's yours right here, so. That's, That's me? Right That's me? That's Yo. <laughs> Yo, what's up with you, big dog? Hey, how y'all know Tev, man? It's my boy, man. We went to school together. Oh, for real? man. Yeah. All right, so wait. What's what's one of your... What's what's the coolest thing about Tev, dog? Man, just a humble dude, man. He always been genuine since so I met him. Yeah. Solid dude. For sure, for sure. Uh, yeah. And always putting his boys on, too, I see. Oh, y'all got broccoli. That's the healthy stuff over there. <laughs> Get me away from that today. <laughs> we ain't doing it. Hey, who is Cam right here? Cameron. That's my, that's my little brother, Cam. Yeah? He's 20 years, old, 20 years apart. 20 years apart. 20 years apart. Yeah. That's cool though that you got your family and your you know your people around you, man. That's dope, bro. Man, that's cool, man. Look, my stomach about to touch my back, dog. I ain't ate nothing all day. Man, I'm excited for this, man. Look, look, look. I've been seeing this man everywhere. I know that I just said this about 30 times, but look at this, bro. Look at this. I'm, look at it. Look at it. Yo, he got the mat going on. You know, I like my mat creamy. You know what I'm saying? It's past the look check, the look of it, the uh, uh what y'all call the presentation. 30 out of 10. <laughs> I don't even know where to even like start at, bro. See what that we ain't talking about. You couldn't keep yourself composed. Look at that wing, man. Look at how that wing glistens in the sun, boy. Oh my God. I pray this is good, man. I pray this tastes as good as it looks, dog. God! <laughs> <laughs> that was fire, dog. That's crazy. Mm, mm, mm. We should have been came up here, bro. <laughs> we should have been came up here, dog. The wing itself is still mad crispy, bro. Crispy, seasoned well, juicy. Appreciate you, man. I need that. He's me slobbering all of my stuff. He said, bro, you need a napkin. Let me see what the mag hitting on, dog. Let me see what the side hitting on, bro. He can't be. He can't be going crazy like this over here. But good, stupid in the barber shop. <laughs> nah, I don't. I can't, bro. I'm about to hit somebody with one of these right here. I'm about to hit somebody with one of these right here, bro. Cause that is crazy. That's stupid, bro. Yo, I can't. Man, usually, I don't even eat all the food, bro. I chase it. I'm for real, for real, about to eat this whole plate, dog. So that crazy. I'm yeah, sorry, yeah. cuz. I'm sorry, cuz. Oh. <laughs> 
You gonna talk about the food? Don't <laughs> 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 no, <no>, say so. <laughs> hey, this is a real nigga moment, bro. I ain't gonna lie to you, dog. They ain't had chicken this good in a minute. Dang, yeah. ain't even tried nothing else yet. Let me see what this short reel talking about. Oh my god. So apparently he said he do oxtails on Sunday, but the short rib is pretty much like the same seasoning. They cooked it the same style, the same everything. Look at that. It's just a short rib, right? It's looking good. If them wings, <laughs> them wings are 30, nigga. <laughs> if the wings is that crazy, I can only imagine what this is gonna be like. That's like grandma. That shit's like grandma. That shit's like mom. That tastes like auntie. <laughs> but this is Tab. <laughs> but that don't even eat no hot sauce, dude. God, dog. But, but that dang season so good. Maybe you want to eat the gristle. <laughs> yeah, that man crazy. That man crazy. Look, I ain't even had no broccoli yet. Mm. <laughs> Yeah, eat your grease at all. Okay, yeah, brought but look, bro. That plus that, I wouldn't even be able to choose one over the other, dog. They both 30s. <laughs> they both 30s. A jerk salmon, what's this in the thing right here? Some type of sauce or something? Like a jerk sauce or something. Let me see this mother talking about. Get that close up right there and pull that on there like that. Yes, sir. Oh my God. Why is he playing with me like this? Oh, let's see that. Mm. Mm -hmm. Okay, yeah, it's semi hype. Yeah, it's semi hype. It's semi hype. You know what I'm saying? I'll say, the salmon's cool, you know. It's got a nice little flavor on there. It is a little on the dry side, you know what I'm saying? But the wing. And this uh, uh, short rib, <laughs> this game over for all you restaurants out here in LA. <laughs> if y'all ain't coming with this, I don't even want it. <laughs> Tender, real flavorful. Ain't too much fat on there. Slide off the bone easily. You can't fight it, man. You can't beat it nowhere else, dog. That way. <laughs> mm. Hey, boss. Let me wrap on this. Let me wrap on that. <laughs> this is getting eight all the way up. <laughs> mm hmm. Oh, my God. That one. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> bro, sorry. I can't stop. Bro, wait. What, I got some drinks over here? What is Some type of punch? But looking a little, oh, good. I'm about to go to the gym today, bro. Mm-mm. There's no. <laughs> God. <laughs> Fire. The perfect mix of sweet and tangy, man. It tastes like Kool-Aid or something. Mm. Like I said, fall after. Ah, ah. I always feel like it is like the mom and pops, man. The people who start out of their crib and stuff like that. Like you did. That's where you find the best food at, bro. I just pray that the more successful he becomes, that this quality stays the same, bro. Because a lot of times they be losing it sometimes, bro. But I hope. Mm. No, no. Yeah, day, I hope you stay the same, man. Tev, man. What's going on, man? This is crazy, dog. Yes, sir. You a bad man, brother. Appreciate for real, for real, dog. I want to say thank you. <laughs> so, I appreciate you, bro. I, I want to say you. thank you yes, <laughs> for blessing that. my uh, stomach with this right here, dog. This is crazy, man. Bro, no, I, I was just telling, bro, like, I wish y'all nothing but success. You know, your quality 
is all the way up here, bro. I hope you never lose that, dog. Because a lot of a lot of folks, you know, they start out going strong like right. this, right. and then once they get too corporate, man, right. they no, be cutting right corners. Here. This huh? my strong right here. Yeah, getting stronger. You know what I'm saying, like, wow. I'm just, Went through all the motions, you know, get it where it need to be. Yeah. And I'm only going to do better. Yeah, man. Now, I hope to see this place packed out, man. Which, so, wait, what was this building, by the way, dog? What? I'd say inside, they had, like, a lounge slash, like, you know, just, like, a hangout spot for whoever was renting it. Yeah, uh, dog. That's right. And <laughs> yeah, that's all day long. But, yeah, they had it, They had it like, this is a big open spot, kind of like a lounge, small kitchen and everything. And then outside, they had nothing. Right here, um, we got the place. I'm like... You know, I have people that come from far, like this drive. They be like, bro, you know, I just came from San Bernardino, right? Wow. I'm like, so you got to go back. So it's like they drive, sit in their car and eat. I'm like, no, nah, I don't really like that. So I invested in this right here for everybody that's driving far. You know, if you just want to stop by, yeah. that's fine also. But I just don't like to see it, bro. People coming from far, driving, sitting in their car and eating, then hitting the road for another two hours. I'm like, I come, I chill, and I eat. All right, now I, ain't I hear a little bit of a, like a slight accent. You know, I got to hit the road. Yeah. Like, what you, what you like, J J Jamaican? Born and okay, raised. Okay, okay. Well, look, I got to make sure I'm right. politically Jamaican. correct. Now, we Jamaican, all Jamaican, born and raised, man. Really? So, what, your whole family out there? Whole family live out there. Everybody we see here and probably, like, three or four more people, yeah. that's all we have here. Yeah. I'm saying it's probably, like, what, 14 of us from one family out of Jamaica? Yeah. Yeah, my grandpa, he's he been here since the 80s. Really? And then, you know, my mom and them came in in the early 2000s. I came in 2010. You know, so I was the last set to come, you know, and then I was also the first one to start something and to involve everybody as a family. You know what I mean? Just trying to you, you the it. pioneer, man. You yeah. the pioneer. Every family got that one. Yeah. You know, the, the pioneer that changes it for everybody, right. dog. You know what I mean? Cool. So, wait, who, who taught you how to cook, though? Your mom, your pop? Like, who? What? I would say everybody in, all, in general, you know, I watch them and I just take it up a notch. And I also used to cook, bro. I used to cook when I was a kid. I've been cooking since I was, like, 10, 11 years old. Like, you know. No, run away from the yard. Parents know where we at. Go to the river and cook. You know what I'm saying? So all our friends, you know, if you don't got, say for instance, you got an onion. I'll bring some rice. He brings some flour. Somebody bring one one thing from the yard. Meet up at the river. Have little kids and cook. But I was always a chef since since I as long as I could remember. So it's like everything is being done. Tev, 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 tev. So I'm like, came out here. I was still the chef, but I was doing it for free. Like at my friend's house or wherever I go. Bro, can you cook this? Yeah, why not? And then. I'm like, I see value in this. You know, I like to cook. It's a passion of mine. And I, I'm happy when I cook. You know what I mean? If I'm not cooking, bro, it's just, I feel like I'm kind of like depressed. I don't know if it's, I don't know if it's, I don't know if it's like normal, but it's like, I'm not cooking. I'm just like literally depressed. And it's just like from the people that's coming in, the good vibe and people like you that believe in us, like, you know, that see what we I believe. <laughs> I believe. <laughs> yeah. And I see what we actually do. You know what I mean? Just keep it going, bro. No, nah, that's dope, man. That's dope. Um, you know, it sounds like you found your purpose, dog, you know, in life and whatnot. But I, I heard you touch on something that was uh, very interesting, bro. You was doing it for free for a minute, you know, for a while. And then you found a way to monetize, like, your passion. Can you talk a little bit about that? You know what I mean? Like, what it's like to, to have people always, like, wanting the free, the free, the free. At what point did you have to put your foot down and be like, all right, I got to start, like, I can't be doing it for free no more. Well, everything costs. You know what I'm saying? So if I'm going out, getting my hard work, you know, even if I'm not buying anything, my time costs even more. I got to drive to you. I might, I might catch a flat while I go home. So if I'm coming to you and then if you can't cover what I'm coming to do or my cost, just won't come. You know what I mean? But it was free when it was like beneficial to everybody that was around us, that's around us. But after a while, it became where it's like, I want this now. It's, can we get this now? One and again, was like, you didn't give me no money, you didn't give me anything. But anyway, like, I had to stop, stop doing it for free because it was, it got to a point where I was going to work and I come home, still do stuff for free. I'm like, y'all rushing me, y'all arguing, come do this, come do this, but I'm not getting paid for it. Which, because that's the that part, that person I am. If I can help you, genuinely I will help you. You know what I mean? But when you start taking advantage of me, that's why I'm like, okay, I'm going here kind of like a routine to do the same thing I'm doing. So it's, that, I feel like I'm taking advantage of. You know what I'm saying? I see my family, they also cook very good. And then like we have the house loaded with people, 20, 30 people, everybody's eating for free. I'm like, y'all go home, we don't have no leftovers. That's the best part. Like after Thanksgiving, bro, no leftovers, you're gonna be pissed off. So it's like, they'll come, they'll eat, they'll leave. I'm like, okay, we gotta put a stop to this. And then one year was like, hey, everybody put up money. Let's make Thanksgiving to them. Nobody. Nobody, just, nobody. It's a regular family. Yeah. Okay. So I'm like, okay, now we cook and we eat. Yeah. No, that's dope, man. That's dope, man. Because I, I ask because it's a lot of people right now who watching this, man. Mm -hmm. And, you know, it's a lot of people out there who really want to turn, you know, 
they love free stuff into like an actual you know business and like make money from it so it's inspiring to hear somebody who went through it and like did it all right the last thing i'm gonna ask you i ask everybody man how, how old are you i'm 29 i just turned 29 you just turned 29 yeah. oh damn happy birthday man i'm 28 yeah yeah, yeah. yeah august 14th so if you go back, you know, my cousin is 18. Mm -hmm. You know, if you go back and tell, yeah, he 18, yeah. If you go back and tell your 18-year-old self anything, what would you tell him? If I can go back and tell my 18-year-old self, just go for it. Like, a common thing out here in America out here is, like, you have time. And you don't because it don't really make a difference if you're doing it at 20 or 30. It's just you're getting older, you know what I'm saying? But it's like when you're younger and you start a business and people see value in it, they'll attract to you more. When you get older, you're like, man, you should be able to figure it out. And I feel like that's what L.A. oftentimes experience because I know a lot of good, good food places, but it's because they're older and they're not on social media. They don't get the love they deserve. You know what I mean? But I come here, and it's like, if I could tell you as an 18-year-old, as I said, bro, just go for it, no matter what your parents say. Because if I listen to my parents, I probably I did go to college. I dropped out because I didn't want to go to college. You know what I'm saying? After a while, I'm like, I found food. I was doing clothes. I was doing parties. I was doing all type of stuff. And I found food. I'm like, this is it. And when 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 it is it, you're gonna know. You're gonna feel it. It's like everything you do is gonna revolve around your purpose, as you said. It's walking in my purpose, man. Walking with God, walking with my purpose, bro. And you don't have to find answers from people. Just pray. And you, I don't know, y'all believe, bro, but I believe. And whenever I pray, I literally watch it turn out to be like reality. You know what I mean? Because I, I walk, I believe, and I also help a lot of people. A lot of people, bro, like people don't, I don't take the camera and stick it in somebody's face. That's just what I do. I like to help people. And then when you help people, I feel like it multiply in ways that you don't even realize. You know what I mean? But if I can go back and tell my personal self, like when I was 18, tell my personal self is just do it bigger. Don't think small. Because if you start off small, you have to grow. You know, you have to grow and grow and grow. If you start off big, like, okay, I'm going big. It's going to get bigger. If you're doing the right thing, you'll get bigger. Right. I mean, yeah. Nah, 100%, man. Nah, that's great, man. I love to hear little nuggets of wisdom, little golden gems from everybody I meet, bro. Yes, Look, dog, like I said before, I wish you nothing but success, brother. Yes, I hope, yes, like I said, I hope this man get 35 million <laughs> locations across the goddamn universe, man. Man, if y'all get a chance, come down here, try this man out. Let me know what you're thinking. As always, where should I go next?